Ravage84. You're older than me, and he likes violent pornography. I'm assuming, obviously. Good for you, buddy. A lot of people have, like, 84, 86, 90, you know, like, I think, I, I imagine that that's their birth year. I don't know if I like that. It doesn't... I mean, what? who cares, you know? Like, really. Oh, come on, Ravage, really? I was, uh, I was pretty excited to see you, man. You don't want to play? You don't want to play? What is with all these people not wanting to play? Like, the last couple of days have been like this. It's really driving me nuts, man. Uh, whoops. That's a little too far. Uh, custom match. Take a look at all these people. Let's go to the next guy. Because if I try to do quick match again, I'm just going to get Ravage, and I know he doesn't want to play. And this German dude, I assume, does want to play. This is definitely keepable. I mean, I only have two lands, but, I mean, most of my shit is just two land, right? Maybe not most, but the biggest hump in my uh, mana curve is around two land. My my average is probably around three-something. Low, th low threes. So, geez, bitch. I can't even try to pronounce that, man. I have no idea. Uh, I don't like your name. I don't like your title. Your avatar is uh, that Demir thing, but you're not playing Demir Colors. And you do have the right amount of cards. So, at least you're good there. <laughs> at least you're good there, pal. Let's hope I get a land here. No idea what he's playing. Gruel Colors, but I don't know. Uh, no land. Damn. That's not good. But I do have double Rabble Master, so when I do get a land, I'll be happy. What I will probably dump is... Oh, do I want to dump the Kiln Fiend? I might actually dump the Kiln Fiend, because of this hand, I think it's the weak... No, wait, why would I do that? No, oh my god, I'm so stupid. Like, clearly I have a two-drop right here, and I'm thinking about dumping it. It's like, no, I have a play. I'm good for a couple more draws. Oh, man. I'm such a noob, man. <laughs> I'm such a freaking noob. I, like, I don't count damage on the board. I don't read how many lands I have. Ooh. Oh, man. Do I want to double the... Go you know what I do? Because he's playing Gruel, and if he has um, Anger of the Gods, I'd rather him drop it with uh, on, on Rabble Master and those 10 million tokens of his than, uh, than my Kiln Fiend. Because I have a backup for my Rabble Master, I don't have a backup for my Kiln Fiend yet, although I do have more Kiln Fiends. But this is going to make a board state that would make him wipe it the field. My Kiln Fiend will not. So if he has a board wipe or, or even single target removal, there it is, okay. That's fine. That's exactly what I wanted to see, because I got another one coming anyway. So he's taking two here. And again, that's exactly what I wanted to see. Um, I could do Kiln Fiend and then just Cloud Shift it to safety, or even Cloud Shift this for an extra card. Uh, I do have two Flings to go with the two Active Treasons. Uh, I'm going to hold off on that because I think the most aggressive play right now is to drop the second Rabble Master. And that's probably going to eat up whatever le whatever removal he has left. And and him using Banefire, that's pretty desperate removal because Banefire has a lot more potential than just you know getting rid of a two two. And spending three to kill a two two is is pretty rough, especially when you can just cast one to kill a two two. So I'm feeling I'm feeling good. I feel like I have him thoroughly on the defensive. Demolish on one of my lands is going to suck, and my white land on that on top of that that really does suck. So so. I think we can safely assume he's playing, uh, he is playing Land Destruction, which is really good that I have Rabble Master out right now. Uh, do I drop the planes anyway? I don't know, man. Yes. Yes, I do. I drop the planes anyway. I could put the Kiln Fiend out. Uh, I'm not going to. I, I still think that he's got some kind of uh, mass removal. And he's going to pop my my land again, huh? No, wait, wait. No, that's not what I thought it was. Uh, but that's pretty much game right there. So, uh, good, go good job for my opponent. Uh, land Destruction or 
Gruel, I guess. Uh, Gruel isn't that difficult to play. Good game, man. Thanks for the GG. Thanks for the friendly play. Oh, damn. Sorry. Damn. Oh, well. I mean, he's still dead. Ugh. Oh, yeah, he's, he's still dead, actually. Is he? Yeah, he is, because I got a, uh, a fling that's going to his head. It's just going to take me longer now, <laughs> like an idiot. God, that's dumb. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is good for him. Oh, man. What a stupid play, man. You know, you should never, ever listen to me. He's got trample. I can stop four damage, but I won't. Uh, this is definitely game now because uh, he attacked with that instead of kept it as a blocker. So uh, let's just do that again. <laughs> and God damn. What a dumb move. Attack with all attack. Okay. <laughs> He's a cool guy. I can't pronounce your name, but I love you, buddy. You're cool. This, th that's the kind of attitude, that, that guy is the, uh, the kind of attitude that I hope we have, uh, I don't want to do that again, that we have the, um, I, I hope the community is like that guy, really, I, I like guys like that, he's super cool, uh, if, do, if I jump on him again, do we play again? Yeah, I guess I will, I mean, I know what he's running, he knows what I'm running. TLT Eltarn. Eltarn. Hey, at least you have a pronounceable name. Uh, don't like this. One lander. No way. That's a little bit better. Not a lot better. Don't have any real creatures to play. Pretty desperate for another land. Don't have any draw. See, that's that's the issue with my with my deck here. Like, I need I need something to grab more lands, and that's why I'm thinking of running green. Or maybe just scouring white and looking for like those land grabs in white because I don't think red has any I mean that that does I mean I got lucky there right no way I'm shocking that one one and I'm actually a lot more comfortable having shock in my hand because shock is just such a cornerstone card you know like everyone as soon as you see one red open that this is like one of the first things you think about what if they have a shock this is this is so much better than coordinated assault like I, I can't it, it Coordinated Assault is just too constricting. I would run this over Coordinated Assault all the time. Yes, some situations it would be better, but this is just better in more situations. And when you deal with the future, you, you need to diversify. So the more situations you're better in, the better. Uh, uh, that, that came out kind of weird. What I'm trying to say is diversifying for the future is a better strategy when the future is unknown. If you know what you're facing, then it's better to strategize and to specialize in, in one thing. Complicated complicated economics there, man. I'm sorry, guys, but that is... that. Is, I promise you it's the truth. I swear to God. You just, you're just going to have to trust me on that. Why aren't you swinging? That's weird. Maybe he just misclicked. Do you think he's got removal from my Burmaz? Do you think he does? Mm. I'm gonna try mentor first. Oh yeah. <laughs> cool guy. All right, I like you too, buddy. Oh, trip to hunger. All right, so there, there is the removal. Glad I didn't do Bramaz. That would have been uh, an extra two life for him. He, uh, he is running life gain cards, but I don't know. I don't think he's a life gain deck, so that makes me happy. Um, I'm actually going Gutter Snipe before Brimaz right now. I still think he's got a little more removal. I mean, Black Black doesn't have that much creature control in this iteration. Not like in 2014. Holy crap. But uh, in this one, not too, 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 too much. But in case he's got like a dead weight or something, I I mean, I know Brimaz is pretty resistant to a dead weight, but still and and I want to drop a raise the alarm on his face at some point plus uh, another shock hmm 
Well, I know he doesn't have any board wipes. If I swing, he's almost certainly going to double block. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I am dropping the Brumaz this time. I'm going to hope for a fast land next turn, and then I could double raise the alarm. I'm not swinging because I'm uh, pretty sure he's going to double block. Those two elves are pretty much useless for him right now. And he's running the callers that have a lot of graveyard recursion, so he might even have ways to get them back. Uh, that's somewhat scary for me, considering I don't have any tokens yet. Alright. And it does have Death Touch, so I have to do this now. Yep. Yeah. Gotta do it now. And I will swing. That's fine. I wonder why they do that like that. I wonder if he's doing that because he wants another shot at drawing that card. You think he blocks it? Probably not, right? Oh, he does. Okay, so I, th this kind of tells me that he does have some kind of graveyard recursion. I mean, his colors told me first, but this, you know, whatever. Oh. Okay, yeah, well, there, there, so I gotta play this now. So I get the most value out of it. Before he's... He meets his untimely demise. Sorry, Gutter Snipe. What an angry little guy. Uh, don't like that. I mean, I, I've always wanted to play it, but it's just so slow. My god. It's, whoa, there's some graphical poofy ha happening over there. It's just a little too slow for me, you know? It's just a wacky little card. Um, there's really no reason to use any of my fun tricks right now. I think I'm just going to swing... Uh, this Bermaz, uh, I'd hate to be in his position right now. Very difficult card to get rid of. I think I would have kept the Elvish Visionary and the other Elf, and then he could have hit it with the... Uh... No, he couldn't have done that. Hmm. I'm not sure. I I mean, because with... double blocking with those two guys could have done something here. Alright, that's going to suck for him. Pretty badly. Uh, I don't have. I do have fling, but I don't have the mana to cast it. So if I, I need one more land, so I need one fast land or a cloud shift to make this superb. That that's it. That's all I wanted. Uh, tapping right. I'm tapping right. Give me that. Is that game? That might be game. Uh, six and seven is what? Fourteen. Um, f uh, thirteen. Plus another seven is nope, nope. He's a two. Close. Close. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Whoa, baby. Wacky tobacco going on here. Craziness. Yeah, I'm just going to shock him in the face. Give him the good game. Alright, good game, buddy. Love you a bunch. You played well. You were more fun to uh, play than a lot of other people. That guy put me in a really good mood. Very, very happy. Uh, I'll see you guys uh, next time. Hopefully more players like that are, are going to show up in the community in uh, Origins, which is dropping... Oh my god. Like now right like in a in a day it's going to be crazy all right see you guys later